I'm hearing a lot about people put up with being friend zoned, and you know, some of them are just abandoning trying with this girl, and I, a lot of people just don't realize how to properly get out of being friend zoned, how to get out of the friend zone. Now, let me tell you, the key is persistence. You know who does not get a lot of pussy? Quitters. If you stop, you will have wasted all this effort that you put into this one girl. I know there are people who say that if the one girl that, that you know you have a crush on or whatever, if she doesn't put out, if she says she considers you a friend, you should just, you know, maybe be her friend, maybe not, but the, the bottom line is, what they'll say is, just find somebody else to, you know, try to have sex with. Wrong. Look, being friend-zoned is, it, it is your conquest, you know, you, you want this woman. If you have been friend-zoned, obviously you can't continue the, the straight approach because she's already put that down, so consider it a, a stealth mission. You are, you are going undercover pretending to be your friend, pretending to care about her, and once you've, you know, suffered through all that bullshit, you will actually get to fuck this girl. And this is... She is the, the you know, the enemy cell that you have to infiltrate. Now, that kind of puts a negative spin on it. Her, her body is the castle that you want to take over control of. That's, that's much better. And yes, you already turned down, you know, the, the, the night routine, so what you gotta do is just go in there and gradually take over. And there are people calling this, you know, being a creep or, you know, borderline rapey, and this is so ridiculous. If, if women were not there for us to fuck, why would we so badly want to fuck them? That's just... So anyway, what you definitely want to keep in mind is that you, you deserve this, you know, you, you are earning it. It is not something that she just... It is not hers to control, you know? It's, the pussy happens to be attached to the woman. That, that doesn't make it the woman's choice. The, the idea here... Pussies go with dicks. You want to get your dick wet, she has a pussy. It's, it's that simple. Or, or a mouth, you know? Yeah, fill in the rest of the, the holes, if you will. The idea is, you're putting in all this time, you're being a nice guy to her. Obviously, she should repay that with sex. At, at worst, you should have to be, be patient, you know, put in a lot of time. Pretend to care when she has problems. And, you know, I cannot stress the following enough. Do not cup a feel when she is, like, you know, crying on your shoulder. She... It will take a little more time. What you may want to do is, like, you know, make it clear that, you know, if, if she wants you to, you know, suffer through her crying and, and that kind of shit, she's gonna have to put out, you know, if, if you just tell her, look her straight in the eye, tell her, if I'm staying here, I know you know, you might not have any other friends, maybe I was the, the close one. If you do not put out, then I'm out that door. And that's, that's it. In that situation, you know, she'll, she'll basically have to put out at that point. And, you know, score. I, I do not want you to think about, you know, the, the kind of... People come to me all the time with this bullshit, well, she cried, so what? Did her pussy cry? Did, did her pussy shove you out? 
you were fucking her, you, you know, notching your belt, that's what counts. So, what, what you have to remember is, do not let the woman trick you into making her feel, you know, you do not want to start thinking about her as a person. If you were going to do that, you would have done it at the start. This is, you know, she's there for you to fuck. And that's it. She, she is there to satisfy your urge. And, you know, in fact, you, you want to not, not let her, you know, don't give her a chance to keep you hanging for, for so long, to, to string you along and, and this kind of shit. You know, she's, she's only going to be young for so long. And, you know, you can find somebody else to, you know, yeah, you can find another hole to fill. So, it also, some people, and this is ridiculous, this is one of the stupidest things, people are actually claiming that we guys don't automatically deserve this for, for you know, being, being next to the girl. That it's not literally... Look, I'm a guy, I have a dick, my, you know, I have needs. It is, it is not about the pussy, it is about the dick. And you do not want to try, you know, do not catch feelings. And do not start to think about all this bullshit of what what does she want and you know it's it's about trying to fuck her it's it's really nothing more than that and basically and one of the most important things here is to just hang in there and just make sure that you that you maintain your cover you know i cannot stress the following enough try your best to maintain eye contact i women can tell when you are mentally undressing them or you know if you yeah, if you just keep staring at you know her boobs or her ass i mean yes they are they are they're what you're there for but if she you know, if she gets annoyed with that, then you might lose all chance with this girl. The, just maintain eye contact as best you can. Here's something that I use, something that will, will help you maintain eye contact, because of course you don't actually care. This is not, that is, that is not why you're there. What you want to do is either you know, either focus on her mouth and just imagine mentally, you know, you know, go through the the scenario of her going down on you, and that'll make it a lot easier for you to focus on her mouth. Or, you know, if you really gotta go for the eyes, and this one is a bit trickier. This one, I really, I I recommend more to the, you know. The, the career friend zone breaker. This is this is not if you think you can. If if you really gotta go for the eye contact, imagine coming in her face, including in her eyes. And that will make it a lot easier. And this 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 is also very important if you are doing this, make sure to not let a smile come on your face, especially if she's talking about her problems. This this might clue her in to the fact that you're not actually paying attention. And just if if you absolutely cannot get with this girl, if you if you end up just having to to you know throw in the towel, call it quits. There is a chance that you, in the long run, could, if, you know, if, if she didn't really realize that you were only there to fuck her, if she thought you were actually her friend, if, you know, if after a while it just, you, you know, you end up going your separate ways, you know, 
parting on it, you know, to do, make sure not to break it off in this really, you know, bitter way. Just suppress the bitterness, you know, don't, don't tell her how you actually feel about it, because then, then, you know, then all hope is lost, obviously, especially if she tells her friends. You might actually, you know, you don't want people to realize this about you, especially women. Or you just, you'll have no chance at all. In the long run, maybe she will, you know, try to come back to you and, and say, you know, she's, she's ready for a relationship with you. And in that case, you can turn around and dump her. And that way, you, you know, it's just that sweet little just get one over on her. And, and that way, it, it won't be, you know. And, and another thing to, to remember, if, if a girl, you know, if a girl friend zones you and, and you're just, you're, you're sticking around and you see her dating, you know, one asshole after another and she still won't put out with you, you know, the important thing is to just, you know, su suffer through the assholes and, you know, Eventually, you might have a chance with her. The, the thing to really remember is, you know, just because she's not having sex with you now, she might later on. And, you know, just, yes, if, if she, you know, if she never actually has sex with you and you're, you know, being nice to her, you have been wrong. Obviously, you know, we're men, we, we understand this, this, you know, this is, this is a wrong thing to do, you know, it's kind of fucking cock tease, you know, but the important thing is, we're the only ones who realize that it is not actually against the law. I know, I know, I don't understand it either. There's, there's going to be a link to a petition, so just... The important thing is to not actually break the law yourself, because then you might get in trouble. I, we know that this is, you know, you're, you're just in it for the sex, but it is important that you try, at least, not to break any laws to, to get that sex. And, if, you know, if you, if you absolutely must, then you really do have to pressure her into keeping quiet. Maybe, maybe you know, just remind her that, you know, you've, you've been her friend all this time and just, you know, you can't rape your friends. It's just, you know, it doesn't, doesn't happen. If she thinks that maybe you did something that was, you know, that crossed the line, then she's probably just being a frigid bitch. And you don't have to put up with that kind of shit. Just, you know. So, the, the important thing is to, to remember that if, you know, whenever she dumps someone, you know, no matter how big of an asshole he was, just make sure that she knows that you're there for, you know, if, if she needs a pity fuck or something, just, you know, and just, you know, sweet talk her. It doesn't, you're not going to be there afterwards, so don't worry, you know, you're, you're there to, to fuck her, and then you can move on to another person, you know, but it, it can be tricky to take on the role of the asshole yourself to try to, you know, make her realize it doesn't have to be other, you know, other actual assholes. It could be you and, of course you're not an asshole. You're, you're being nice to a girl. It, you know, it doesn't matter that you're hoping for sex in return. You're being nice to her. It's just, I mean, a lot of, a lot of women just don't even realize the kind of shit we go through just, just for a fuck. So, so, it, it can be tricky, though, to, you know, if, to, to put on the, the asshole act. It's important that, 
not too many other women see it because if they're not into assholes and they might have fucked you otherwise, you just ruined your chances. And she might not completely fall for it because she's already known, you know, she's seen you be nice and, you know, as much as that can suck, you know, I mean, you, with a lot of women, you really only have the one chance to make a good enough impression to get in her panties, but, yeah, so, so, just be very careful with that one, is all I'm going to say. I really hope this has been educational, because I, I can't believe that there are actually guys out there being nice to women and still not getting to fuck them. That is ridiculous. If you're, if you're showing a woman positive attention, she should reward you with a fuck. That is just, I don't, I don't care how many times this happens. I don't care how often, yeah, she might, you know, spend most of, you know, the, the 24 hours of the day just fucking guys, but so what? It's what she's there for. And remember, think, question, research. Don't take anybody else's word for it, and that includes mine. Please rate and comment, and hey, if you like this video, that subscribe button's just waiting for you to click it.